Today, I'll show you how to set up your Google AdSense account and then connect it with your WordPress website by adding the code to the default WordPress editor or adding it to Elementor, whichever you prefer. Then select the type of ads that you want to run and how to display them on different parts of your website. We'll go step by step so it's easy to follow. Now, before we get started, your website needs to satisfy all the items on this checklist. Otherwise, your application might get rejected by Google. So once you've done all of this, just visit this website, sign in with your Google account or create a new one. Enter your website URL, then click save and continue. Complete the remaining steps and submit your application. Google will review your site and upon approval, you'll receive an email. Now to connect AdSense to WordPress, go and search for a plugin called Sidekit by Google. Then just open it and follow the steps it gives you. And at the end of it, your AdSense account will be linked to your site. Then you can access performance insights. Now before we move forward, adding ads to your site can slow it down, which will actually harm your SEO as well as your conversion rates. So you should also install a free plugin called Airlift like I have here. Let me just quickly open and show you. As you can see, it increased my site speed a lot and does a whole bunch of optimization on its own for free. It's built by the same team as Melker and Blogworld, so it's safe to trust as well. And yeah, lots of value here for free. So to get it, you can just visit airlift.net and download the plugin from here. Okay, now coming back to Google Ads, if you're just starting this process, you should go to Ads, the auto ads. These are great because they require minimal setup and optimize your ad placements automatically, helping you maximize revenue with ease. So just turn this on. You can even customize where the ads will appear, whether it's on your homepage, within articles or in the sidebar. This is a great segue to discuss the different types of ads that you can add to your site. Then we have display ads, which are more visually engaging with images or videos designed to catch your visitor's attention. In-feed ads are another option, integrating smoothly into your content feed so that they appear less intrusive and more like a natural part of your site. Similarly, in-article ads are placed within your articles, offering a seamless reading experience while still being noticeable. If you are looking to have more control over where your ads appear, you can manually add the ad code to your site sidebar. Start by creating a new ad unit in your AdSense account. Go to Ads tab and click on new ad unit. After setting it up, copy the ad code provided, then head over to your WordPress dashboard, go to appearance, and then widgets. Here, you'll find the option to add a custom HTML widget to your sidebar. Simply paste the ad code into the widget and save your changes. When it comes to creating your ad layout, you have the option to do it manually or let AdSense handle it automatically. For a manual setup, you'll need to create ad units in AdSense, copy their code, and then place these codes in specific areas of your WordPress theme files or widgets. For example, you could place an ad in your header by editing your theme's header PHP file. On the other hand, if you prefer a hands-off approach, you can enable auto ads and AdSense will automatically handle the ad placement based on the settings you choose. For those using Elementor, adding ad code is straightforward. Open the page you want to edit in Elementor and drag the HTML widget to the desired location on your page. Then paste the code into the widget and click update to save your changes. If you're using WordPress default page builder, open the page you want to edit, click the plus icon to add a new block and select custom HTML. Paste the ad code into the block and save your changes. Comment below if you have any questions and I'll help you out. Click this video if you want to triple your site speed in just one minute. You're really gonna thank me for this. So click here and I'll see you there.